Listen, listen. I know I'm late. I know. I've been putting off playing this game for so long. I'm not gonna lie, when this first came out, it was buggy. But that was five years ago. And now, I keep hearing things like how immersive it is, how it's a diamond in the rough. So, I'm giving this game a chance today. And I'm gonna play Kingdom Come Deliverance. What are we delivering? I'm not sure. But this is my first playthrough. I know nothing of the story. I only know that I think the main character's name is Henry, but that's it. So let's check it out. New game. Hardcore. Um, oof, maybe not. Maybe not. Fifteenth century Holy Roman Empire Charles IV But his son Did something Okay, okay Wow That's gorgeous actually And the music! Why is it so good? Are we... in Germany? Where is this? husband how goes it good I should get it finished today where on earth is Henry I need him to run some errands he was still sleeping when I went out at this hour blue, it's blue like 6 a.m. <laughs> wow. it looks like he was out all evening drinking like a lord <laughs> go and get the lazy bones up <gasps> Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. Henry! <laughs> get up now. There's work to be done. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slug of bed. How yeah. old is he? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. <laughs> it's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You'd better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Oh, don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself, is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue.
All this before having your first cup of coffee. A fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? Character. By means of the first two choices in this dialogue, you will select your character's default characteristics. If you're not satisfied with them, not to worry. All characteristics can be further developed without limitations. We were chatting, speech, I was dancing, I was with Bianca, which is vitality, or I was working in the forge. What should we choose? What does he look like? Let's say speech. We were chatting in the in the tavern. Uh, nothing much. Me and the lads were just having a chat in the tavern. Some wayfarer stopped by. He was telling us what's going on in the world, and um, well, I uh, I lost track of time. Well, I hope he didn't fill your head with nonsense. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. And that suspicious looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. Why would I be interested in sword fighting? Matthias was teaching me archery. Ooh, archery. Yes. No, it's just... Matthias was teaching me archery. Archery? Do you want to become a poacher? Have you any idea of the punishment for that? And where did you get a bow, anyway? Oh, come on. I've no interest in poaching. It's just a bit of fun. <sighs> Christ, give me strength. Just don't do anything stupid. For the love of God. Promise. I promise. <laughs> Poor Henry. Have my friends been here? I'm hungry. Is Pa angry at me? Do you need help? Sure. Do you need help? Do you need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. Have my friends been here? Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Uh, you're misjudging them. I have good friends. Hmm. Well, I don't know my friends just yet. My friends aren't drunks. Matthew and Fritz aren't drunkards. I never said they were, did I? And if I really minded you going for a beer with them, I'd have put a stop to it long ago. I was young once too, you know. And your father was no angel when he was in Kuttenberg. We saw that. Give me an example. Be silent. I'm going to be silent. <laughs> you're not a boy anymore, Henry. You're a man. And it's time to start acting like one. Yesterday, you promised your father you'd help at the forge. If you made yourself useful now and then, I wouldn't mind your mischief making so much. I'm hungry. Well, she doesn't need help. Is Pa angry at me? Father angry with me for sleeping late. He's not Papa. happy. Yesterday, you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Sir Radzik. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain. But he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. Of course. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. I'm hungry. Can I get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. Okay. Thanks, Mama. Skeletons. Ooh. Brand new game. Yes. Can I take this? To eat any food. Pick it up. I can't pick up while I'm eating, but I can't pick it up when I'm standing. Okay. Interesting. 
Interesting little house. That must be really cold in the morning. Can I pick up anything? Cheese. I feel like I'm going to make a lot of references about Skyrim. When playing this game. Like for example, when I... because I, I've played Skyrim for many many hours! And I used to pick up everything I saw. Everything. I'm always trying to pick up stuff. Open? Oh. Did I just take 15 apples? I think that's a bit much. I mean, we can always come back. But it's not too, too heavy. Hmm... I'm taking all of winter's rations. <laughs> okay. Wow. You really feel like you're in a little village. Interesting. The compass will tell you, go to father. So I have two objectives on my compass. Is there a map? Oh, wow. Oh, that looks so good. Go to your father. Is that me? Sword fighting lesson. And this is Scalettes. What is this? Ah, oh, the map is gorgeous. Eat from pot. That was a squishy... A squishy soup? That's nice. Can I jump? Can I crouch? Okay. Calm down. I'm so excited. Can I run? Yes. Wait, I should go see Papa first. Wow, they did a really nice job with the ambiance. Like, you really feel like you're walking on a dirt road. Oh, papa papa mama said to come see you oh what's the matter with you henry didn't you hear me calling you persuasion sometimes you need powers of persuasion i can use speech if i look dangerous people will be afraid to cross you so intimidation can sometimes rely on money to do the talking for you. Don't like doing that. In special cases, you can try any other skill. Horsemanship. Okay. But different approaches work on different people. You won't intimidate a tough brawler easily and no matter how well you dress, you won't impress the nobility easily. Huh. So I have reputation. I won't read everything out loud, I'll just put it there and you can pause it if you want to read it. But the reputation thing is interesting. Huh. I had to do something. 
Sorry, I wanted to have a look around. Well, it's my papa, so I want to be nice with him. Sorry, father. I was taking a stroll and lost track of time. Somehow I had a feeling I was seeing everything for the first time. How, my boy? When are you going to get some sense? Anyway, we've a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money, then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? Not drunkard? <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure I'll be happy to hear it. <laughs> Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasau. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now. Work won't wait. Okay. So, I'm sure this is gonna take me all day. My quest log. Oh my gosh. Unexpected visit. We finally got some fine spring weather. But I slept late this morning until 6 a.m. It was a bit hard getting out of bed in the morning. Go to the sword fighting lesson. Buy a bag of charcoal at the market. Collect the debt. Pick up the cross guard. What's a cross guard? Buy ale at the tavern. Sidekicks? That's me, Henry. <laughs> okay. Looks like a normal villager. Nourishment 63? Ah, oh, so I could eat a bit more. Inventory. I'm gonna eat an apple. Wow. So there's a survival element in there. Okay, so we're in the, we're in the vicinity of a castle. Oh, what should I do first? I want to explore. Let's go at the castle first, because it's right there. Hello. Can I pass? I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzik, and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and pommel. Father had them engraved in Sasau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? Where shall I start? Ah, <laughs> shut up and give me what I want or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. So I got a cross guard. You just had it on you? Okay. I thought I could go in the castle. Maybe later. Can I pick up some flowers? Dandelion. 
Wow. Collect the debt from Kunesh. Let's do that first. Can I put a marker? Okay. Who are you, a villager? Charcoal burner. God save you, Henry. You're his helper. Good health to you. Bye. Charcoal, but I don't have any money. Can I sell apples, for example, or? Okay, so this is what I'm wearing. I mean, I need apples for nourishment. I have to collect my... the debt first. Here? I'm trespassing? But it wasn't locked. If you go where you're not supposed to, people will first warn you before calling a guard. Okay. Kunesh? God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? Uh, my papa sent me for money. My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Um... Pay the lot, or else. I mean, we live in the same village. I'm gonna have to w walk past him. Pay for the tools, at least. You know you I'm gonna try to be reasonable. More than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Depths, mm, maybe this one? Look, I know things aren't easy. The wife ran off, booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. <laughs> it's no wonder you're short of coin. But a debt's a debt, and I can't leave here without something. You son of a whore. I failed. How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Sure. You're gonna fight me? No! I can kick him. This is way too much information. Let's just try to wing it. I am going to destroy you. Ouch! Can I kick you? Miss. Oh. Ow. Sir. Why is this so tough? <laughs> What's happening? What the hell? Well landed. What the hell is happening? Go to mother. You had it coming, you pup. And your old man can fuck off too. Sir. Should I reload? What does my quest say? So, that did not go well. Go to mother, she'll patch you up. I'm gonna take them from you, sir. I'm gonna go into your house and I will rob you blind! Ma 
Mama, he hit me. Now, where's Mama? <laughs> Wait. I'm gonna trespass. Where are his tools? Your house is a dump, sir. Oh, I think that... Mm, that might not be his, his house. Mm, a locked chest. I'll need a lockpick to get into that. Fritz might have one. Fritz? Fritz? Who's Fritz? I'm gonna eat your food. Okay. Where is Fritz? And who is Fritz? Okay, we'll find Fritz. Fritz? No. Fritz? No. Are you Fritz? No. Hmm. Am I trespassing here? Boop! Yep. Okay, let's uh, walk around. I'm just looking for Fritz. They're just random villagers. Jane, Baron's wife. Are you Fritz, Baron? Are you looking for me? Traitor? Maybe they're in the tavern. Who are you? Some change for you here. Maruna? I'm all banged up. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts. Traitor. German, now, see? Even the Pope God be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsche spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't and forget about Kutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. 
Well, what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson, doesn't he, Fritz? You too, I'm of you. Oh, you're Fritz? Proper hiding. <laughs> you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit. It made me think of that huge pile of manure. Oh no. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather touch it to be honest. But doing some tears will do. <laughs> what are you saying, Henry? <laughs> but I was going to get ale for father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Saratic sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not gonna take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? I'll do it, but I need your help in return. Of course I'll do it. All right, I'll do it. But then you have to give me a hand with something. What do you need? A lockpick. Kuna shows money to father and doesn't want to pay. I tried talking to him, but he wouldn't listen. I need more than words to get coin out of him, and I can't handle it on my own. No problem. We'll back you up. Just as soon as we're done plastering Deutsch's house. I'll be happy to sort out that drunk. No, off. I don't want to right. beat him up. Let's go while Deutsch is still sitting. I just want a lockpick. Oh, no. Me and the boys? What are you... Where are you going? Oh no, it's going all wrong! <laughs> what are you guys doing? Okay. This is not going... How I want it to go. Okay. First of all, wait! Where are you going? Good health to you, Henry. And who is Fritz? You? Matthias? Fritz. Fritz, I need to speak with you. Listen, there's this locked chest I need to get into. I think Please. it's too late, though. An honest stray not good enough for you anymore. It's just that someone has something that doesn't belong to him, and I want to take it back. <laughs> if you say so. That's good at my nose anyway. I've got some lock picks you can have. But if you get caught, you didn't get them from me. <laughs> Never of heard of you. Thanks, Fritz. What a little troublemaker. Okay. I mean... Are you gonna stay there? While Mama patches me up? Where's Mama? Okay, they're just waiting there. This day is not going how I thought it'd go. Wait, where's my house? Oh. Is it getting dark or something? Nothing to see here, Papa. I need to see Mama. She was there earlier. Mama. Ma? Ah, Ma. I'm <laughs> hurt. Won't stop bleeding. Oh now, stop squealing like a baby and show me that. There you are, good as new. You ought to learn to do that yourself. Thanks, Ma. Okay. I'm gonna try... to get the tools. Because I don't want my friends to beat up the man. He's right there. He's gonna see me. Is there another door? Okay. I think I can make it. The 
Let's close this door. I should save. I can't? I can't save? Oh boy. Um... Um... Rotate lock. It doesn't do anything. What? Oh. Oh my gosh. in the world Did I fail? I broke all my lock picks. I think we're going to have to beat him up. I tried though. I tried to save your life. So what am I supposed to do? Put dog shit in his house. I'm a little troublemaker. I mean, not sure why we wa would want to do that, but sounds like fun, right? What's our plan, boys? So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? The Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed <laughs> after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. I wonder if she's gonna react negatively with me because of my face. I mean, because I'm all banged up. What do you want, lad? Your husband's making trouble. I just went by the tavern and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty! The fool! Next thing he'll start on about the Popes! He might have mentioned the Popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. This is gonna affect my reputation. Hmm. Okay. It is done, boys. What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For With our hands? Country! For king and country, my ass. Oh, it's no. All good, clean, fun! <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund! Woohoo! Eat shit, doshes! You <laughs> bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Oh, sons! I'll make those smiles off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutscher? 
Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <gasps> Ouch! <laughs> what the? Fuck her! I'll make you pay for that! What have I gotten myself into? I can't fight a simple drunk man. Oh no. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. What are- What does this- What does this mean? You're dead? What are you doing? For God's sake! Why am I fighting? I don't want to fight you. Oh my gosh. We better fucking run too. Why am I friends with these guys? God be with you, Henry. Thank you. Okay. This is not the Henry I want to be. Hey. And where am I going? First of all, I have to help my father. Ah, uh, okay. I have to go see Kunesh. Listen, Henry had a troubled past. He was friends with the wrong people, and they were a bad influence on him. But I want to turn my life around. So... Are they coming? Oh no. What have I done? <laughs> okay. We're all there. Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. That was pretty close, eh? That old bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, let him. Then I'll snitch on him. <laughs> and anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dog? These are the funniest Good quests. Point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. Okay, we're being little shits. I need help with Kunesh. I need a hand with Kunesh. Sure, mate. You helped us, so we'll help you. Let's get to it, then. Look out. Huh? Kunesh! Get out here, you old goat! I've something to show you! I'll save you, Henry. Oh no. He's running? What the fuck are no. you here for? You want me to take a whip to you or call a catch pole? Just try it, you old drunk. Oh no. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Poor guy. I give up. Take what you want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? I'm a thug. It started out so well, and... Find something worth selling? I'm just gonna rob him. Rob the poor man. I can rob his soup. Yeah. Yep. 
yeah, you didn't deserve that, and I'm sorry. But the boys are a wild bunch. And you beat me up. But still. I don't feel too good about that. But that's okay. It happened. Okay. So now, I'm gonna buy a bag of charcoal. But wait. I... there's something else I should steal? I mean, your house is a dump. But this doesn't really look like his house, though. It looks like... a place for animals or something. Where's your bed? Take what you want! But you haven't heard the last of this. Ah. Okay. So let's get some money. My god. What happened to you? You look like you've been assaulted. Uh, I have. And I'm not proud of it. Let's sell his axe. Right? So, I should sell this um, at the basket. I get what? 5.2 what? Check basket. Close the deal. Haggle. I can try to haggle. Let's talk about the price. Why not? So I want a bit more. Wait. Let's say six. Because I'm selling, right? That's a bit confusing, though. It works both ways. Select the amount you want to pay or get. Okay, I think I think it should be fine. Six. Sure. Let's be reasonable. Satisfied? I'd almost shake on that. Almost. Come on. I mean, it's okay. Make offer. Satisfied? Close. Drop the price a bit more and we'll shake on it. Okay. I don't want to make him angry. That's a sum I can live with. Not too bad. Okay. We got two pennies more. Also, I have to go to the sword fighting lesson and I have to buy charcoal. I want to add 10. Mm. That's too expensive, sir. Oh, but wait. Can we do Does he stay angry? Price? Why not? Okay. So I want to pay a bit less. I want to pay like four pennies. Are we agreed? You won't convince me with that. Oh. What about here? It's reasonable. Okay. 
Oh, I love that system. That's fun. He can't stand the smell of garlic, hates mustard, and bacon is too common for him. Oh, I see. That's what are you talking about? Can you think of any? I need to buy ale. Oh wait, where is the tavern? And what is that on the map? Grocer? Okay. So E is where I need to go. And where's Bianca? <gasps> Bianca! Hello! What do you look like? Oh! God save, my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? You do. Your beauty, of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? Your worship? A pitcher for father. I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Here you are. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening Aww. I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I He's a gentleman. Wait. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. Vanya. I suppose. He is a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite. Save your snacks. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. <laughs> what are save your snacks? To save I need to drink? That's interesting. What's there? Okay, I can't go. What about here? Hmm. Okay, let's train. Hail to the hero! You haven't changed your mind about learning the craft of warfaring. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. But the world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? I'm so distracted by the guy behind who's trying to get past the horse. <laughs> He's just stuck. Yes, let's go. Yes. I wanted right. to drink my we'll savior bottle, but maybe I still have time. Where's my savior bottle? Cross guard for a new sword. Savior snaps. I only have five though. That's interesting. Okay, I'm gonna keep it for later. Combat Master Vanyak. Okay. I'm ready. So, can we get started? Yes. We can. Good. And since today's the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you so far. Yeah. 
very well. Whoa. Let's start with the basics. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. All right, all right. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. All right. Oh. Very good. All right. Now you're getting it. Okay. Good. That's an interesting... The point of the blade is for stabbing. Try it a few times. Now you're getting it. Now you're getting it. Now you're getting it. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Not bad. Again. Good. Nice. Pretty good. The combat system is interesting. Okay. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. You have to work and work. And the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat. There's nothing better than experience, believe me. I'm gonna go see my father. A new level in herbalism. I'm level two. Ah. So the more you use skills, the more you level up. I mean, yeah, because I don't think I can assign points, right? Yeah. Drinking? Houndmaster? I can have a dog? They love me. Um. Oh, that's gonna be fun! Okay. What did you do in Kutenberg? What did you actually do in Kutenberg? Oh, all sorts. You had to be able to put your hand to anything if you wanted to make a living. But I was never far from iron. I'd like to see Kutenberg sometime. I'll take you there one day, never fear. It's a beautiful city, but in the end you'll learn the best place is here by the Sasso. We've kind nobles, fertile land, and plenty of everything. And do you know Sir Radzig well? We've known each other long enough. About the things you wanted. And about time. Have you got everything I wanted? Yep. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. Right, let's see what kind of job the master in Sasal did for us. Look at that lad. Well, that's what I call craftsmanship. What does the inscription mean? Damned if I know. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Radzig ordered it. I saw Libera something. This will be the finest sword I've ever made. We got the charcoal. Good. And fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. By the way, someone paid me a call. I reckon you might know what it was about. I'm not sure. Really? really? <laughs> because I'm pretty sure 
You and your friends threw dung at Deutsch's freshly whitewashed house. He was here with the catchpole earlier, and it was not a friendly visit. What got into you, Hal? That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the King. He got what he deserved. Got what he deserved, did he? You can go and clean up the mess you made and apologize to him. I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody, least of all the king. You understand? Hmm. I didn't yes. even think Look of that. Look me in the eye, Henry. Do you understand? I understand. Yes, Papa. Good. And we'll never have this conversation again. Oh. So you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of our king? You don't care about that. The boy gets caught making a fool of himself and he still hasn't learned his lesson. Exactly. So Deutsch spouts rubbish and what? You turn into a common thug. Exactly. We, we messed up. You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth and not your fists. Aww. Why am I feeling emotional after that? The furnace is ready. Right, we'll do the grip. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. Do it. With his bare hands. Good. Once more. That's it. Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. And here I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles. Had a bridge made over the Moldau and founded a university. And all without a war. He knew hmm. how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. Wow. But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here, and we'll put it all together. It's awesome they would do that together. Wow. Oh, it's magnificent. Indeed it is. The Lord be with you. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. Henry, are you all right? <laughs> Why? Because I look funny? Uh That was such a beautiful moment with his father. Oh, here? Can I 
can take all this. How heavy was that? I'm fine. Here are those nails you wanted. Henry, Thanks. what are you waiting for? So Bring how's Bianca? Um she's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering. Will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Maybe we'll see each other there. Anyway, mustn't keep that you. will I'll do. Go and get those damn so nails. It's truly beautiful. <gasps> Henry, fine lass, eh? Now stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. Wow. <laughs> we did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. Well, those days are gone, sir. Hmm. But you haven't lost your skills, though. Would you like to try it? Sir, what good is a sword to a Let commoner? Then try it. E. His father is unsure. Oh. He's Embarrassing. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows? What the future holds for each of us. Exactly. I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work. Very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. Here you are. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. I'm sure our paths will cross again. They certainly will. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Good work, Martin. Sure. It's been an honor, Sir Ispan. Have a safe journey to Sasso. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. A long, peculiar history. <laughs> that was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. Huh. You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets started. I might teach you how to handle a sword. And then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. You talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in Scalitz, here, beneath the linden tree and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them or beat them. Meet. Mm. You have to keep going on about it. Then you've no need to learn swordplay. Yeah! 
He's very protective of his son. A messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened? What are they doing there? to the house and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry. What about you? I mean, there's no time. Mother is in the village. I'll fetch her. <gasps> Follow right behind. I'll go oh, with no. you. No. You do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sir If anything happens, he'll take care of you. He owes me. Okay. Oh, no. So suddenly, run. <gasps> Who is he? on me Drunkenness? Run? But where? Get a horse. Where though? <gasps> uh, the map is huge! Okay. Wait. 
What is that? Ride. So I have to look for a horse. Oh my gosh. Okay. Where though? <gasps> what? Ew. Excuse me? Where's my sword? I'm bleeding. I'm dying. Come on. Don't be a wimp. Run. Oh. Okay. Okay. So I have to find a horse. I don't see any. Maybe there? I'm gonna have to watch for my stamina. Oh! Yes, there's a horse there, but... Can I go through? Nope. So far, but so close. Where? To hell, you turtle beast! Where? Where's the girl? <gasps> Where? Oh shit. Oh. Oh no! No, 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 no! No! Where are you going? <gasps> I mean... Oh no... Whistling? How? Whistling... Where's whistling? Don't touch her! You'll burn in hell, you un- Oh, 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 <laughs> can I run? Can I run? Can I run? Oh, can I run? Okay, yes, yes, yes. Oh, no, whistling. <gasps> uh oh, okay, horsey mount. How do I write this? Oh! They knocked me off my horse? I'm so dead. I'm so dead! Horsey! Catch me if you can! I'm bleeding. Well, I got away. I'm so invested already. I just started this game. Okay. Run, horsey. Run. Yeah. <gasps> Run. I go, I go. Rona. Ravna. I'm not sure where to go, but passing through. To the left, along the stream. The left? Okay. I would hate Go. living in the medieval Go. times. Go. 
so stressful. Did I get away? A bit? Hmm. Not really. They're so close! Come on, horsey! Run! I'm about to die! <gasps> I have bled to death! They're so close! Run for it! Oh no! How am I supposed to do that? Warn the others. They tore it They're shooting at me. How am I supposed to evade them? Inventory. I can't eat on a horse. Really? Run for it. I'm gonna die. They're right there. How long can I keep this up? Yes. these guys I still have the arrow in my oh in my thigh ow my gosh what a day Ow. Someone give him a drink and bring hot wine and bandages. Tell me, boy, who are you and where are you from? What in hell's name happened? I've come from Scalitz. They burned it to the ground. Slaughtered everyone. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. I've never seen so they don't like know or heard their language. Huh. Maybe Tartars? Tartars, you say? Yeah. Well, we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. Grit your teeth, boy. I'm gonna oh. pull that arrow out. Poor Henry. Easy. All done. You were lucky, lad. The arrow missed the bone. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Can you stand? There you go. Good as new. Ooh. Thank you. If you idlers nothing better to do, get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Divish. Can you manage?
What an interesting Sir, place. This is a survivor from I heard Robart. Tell me, boy, what exactly happened? Did well, you we're see not the sure. signs of the attackers? And were there any more survivors? So, um I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. The ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a, a strange language. They burned Scalitz to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. They could be those Cumans of Sigismund's. It said they came to Hungary from the east, and now they're the core of his army. Oh, they're in Hungary? Sacking okay. Gutenberg. Must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Scalos is a small castle, sir. If Sigismund attacks, they can't hold. Indeed, Sir Robard. And our small garrison would be no help, even if we could risk sending them. You think we're next in line? Maybe. What's your name, boy? I'm Henry, son of the Scalitz blacksmith. I know him. Did he make it inside the castle? I'm sorry. He did not. It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway, thank you for risking your neck to warn us. Robard, take care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Yes, sir. And get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. As you command, sir. Why is this so emotional al already? Like, my eyes are moist. I'm tearing up. I don't know these people. Wow. Well, there you have it. First episode of KCD. I didn't have really high expectations well I didn't know what to expect but these are gorgeous the amount of detail I'm surprised at how emotional I felt when he was talking about what happened in the, in the village with his father and like why do I care so much already this is gorgeous wow I am really pleasantly surprised so far oh. I'm hungry to eat Eat some apples. You have like 58. Yeah, I'm really pleasantly surprised. I'm gonna have a lot of fun with this game. Oops. Okay, you just went through a whole bag of apples. Well, times are rough. And what's interesting is, oh, that's gorgeous. Huh. Okay, I need to gather my thoughts. So I'm surprised how emotional I feel, like emotionally invested I feel after just playing for a few hours. And it's interesting how there are so many different approaches to the quests. So I think that's really interesting. I think I'm going to have a lot of fun with this one. I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.